Hi, I'm Ashraf and this is my presentation. First, what is menu? Menu is a statement of foods and beverage items that are available or provided by the food establishment. There are many types of menu, a lot to talk about, but I just want to focus on Cycle menu, which is the menu consisting of a fixed number of meal types that rotate during a given period of time. For example, let's say there are 7 primary meals that serve at the school. This meal will be offered from 1 week from day 1 to day 7. At the end of the week, the cycle will begin again with meal on day 1. To simply put, a cycle menu offers different meal plans for each day within the cycle. Cycle menus are most often used in non-commercial food service systems that serve the same group of customers every day. The cycle menu follows a particular pattern design that meets the need of the operation customer and depicts on a regular basis. The criteria is simple. A cycle menu is a series of menu that is repeated over a specific period of time. The menu is different each day during the cycle and at the end of the cycle, the menu is repeated. Here are some steps for planning cycle menu. First, get the menu planning resources such as recipes, product information and everything. Second, decide on the length of the cycle. The cycle menu should be at least 3 weeks. Plan the main dishes first. Try to include different main dish. And lastly, add foods to go with and complement the main dish. The cycle menu has many advantages. Cycle menus save time, can also help in controlling food costs. It also will reduce food waste. However, the disadvantages are may be too limited in appeal to customers. Menu cycle may be too short. May limit the chef's creativity and originality. So, now you get the idea of what a cycle menu is. Right. Uh, this type of menu is well established in healthcare school canteen, cafeteria, or hospital meal. In conclusion, menu planning is a learned skill improved through practice. Effective menus are critical to the health of food service operation and serve as the driver of the business. Their importance uh, to a successful food service operation cannot be overstated.